All right, a quick look at Dead at 17 Compendium, Compendium Edition by Josh Howard. Josh Howard is my favorite person working in indie comics. Uh, he's also the creator of T-Bird at Throttle. Uh, Dead at 17 was his first book. He kind of, he did the George Lucas thing where he went back to it and cleaned up some of the panels he, he didn't like. I can kind of see how this is a young artist's work. He's finding his style. He's trying to figure out what kind of story he wants to tell. And I think he perfected it in uh, T-Bird and Throttle, but Dead at 17 has a lot of what I love about Josh Howard. Uh, he's a Christian artist and writer who's willing to talk about his Christian faith in his art, but he's also willing to do hard R-rated zombies ripping people apart and evil demons creating antichrist abominations. So what I like about it is it's zombies, but it's not just zombies as uh, just bl boring bad guy. It's zombies as representative of of the demonic. The hero, Nara, doesn't really know what she believes. So she gets recruited into what's essentially a spiritual battle between uh, Christianity and the demonic, but she herself doesn't know what she wants or what the or what the good is or what God wants her to do. So she's not just like a stereotypical Christian protagonist who's like, yay, yay Jesus. There's this question in her mind that's bugging her. And uh, it, it, she's literally been given a second chance at life and she doesn't know what to do with her second chance at life. So I think it's a very effective example of a Christian bringing Christianity into a story where it really serves the themes of the story quite well, spiritual light versus, spiritual light versus spiritual darkness, but not using Christianity as a magic superpower where you just throw the magic cross at the bad guys and they, and they poof out of existence. So I would, if you like zombie stories and you, you would like a metal, you know, <laughs> bloodbath, you'd like it. And then it kind of, it, what I appreciate about it is it, it, it keeps this idea of Christ uh, in contrast to this metal and demonic world that we all live in. So check it out.